Hey guys, what's up? It's Paul, and today I'm bringing you another figure from Mythic Legion's War of the Aetherblade Wave. This is a really sweet figure. This is the Deluxe Female Elf Builder. What a beautiful figure. Love the elves. Super popular. And this is a deluxe figure, which again means it comes with all the extra parts. And this deluxe figure is really hooked up because she has extra torso. She has extra heads. She has extra armor skirt and loin piece. She has all kinds of cool stuff, which we will take a look at shortly at the table. I'll show you everything she comes with. Another awesome figure. Great paint job on these guys. If you've been following my videos, this is the female elf builder. She's awesome. Love her. They also came out with a bonus head version. Now, I was lucky to grab a bonus head version. And I'll show you the bonus head. It is a beautiful helmeted head. It is painted in a beautiful uh, silver and golds to match the armor. The head, the bonus head on this is just outstanding. Love it. Another fantastic addition. If you're fortunate enough to get the version with the bonus head, which was a very early Kickstarter version of this, it was, you had to get it right from the website. And anyway, that's what this is. Very rare, hard to come by. This is the version you're going to see more of. Does not have that one bonus head, but it has a ton of other great stuff. Now, if you watched my one video about the Deluxe Elf male builder, this is the female that goes with it. And just like that, I'm going to do a custom paint job on her to make her look like a drow. Because I did that on the male builder and it really looks great. I had a lot of great comments. Thank you to my fellow dark elf lovers out there. Yeah. She needs to have the same thing done. It's a beautiful head they give with her. She's gorgeous all the way around. But me, my love of drow. And how cool the other figure came out. I need pictures of the two of them together. So we begin our drow army tonight with this one. And a custom paint job. Which I'll stick a couple pictures of. At the very end of the pictures. I'll put the two drow together. And uh, yeah it will be awesome. So love this figure. Love this line. These Mythic Legions figures are just the best. What can I say. They're absolutely my favorite toys to open and play with, to have, to display, everything about them I love. And these guys are awesome. I can't wait. We're almost going to have the big reveal of who's coming out in the All-Stars 6 wave. Going to be exciting. I'll make announcements about it. And also, some really cool news that I just got. But... I'm actually going to have a table at Legions Con, which is the big Mythic Legions convention in New Jersey. And I'm actually going to be there. I'm going to have a table. I'm going to have stuff from my 3D printing company there, which is Trollhead Studios. You can find a link down in the description if you want to check some of the stuff out that's there. It's going to be a lot of fun. I'm super excited about it. And I'm hoping that some of the people that watch the video come up and say hi at Legion's Con. But anyway, let's get back to the review. We're going to take this girl over to the table. We're going to take a quick look at her. We're going to take some pictures. And then we're going to come back here and wrap it up. So let's go. So let's take a quick look at what the figure comes with. She's got the figure. She has a torso that you can switch out. She has the shield. She has a belt. She has the loin piece, the skirt, and two sets of pauldrons. Then she has an elf helmet. She has a knight helmet. And she comes with this cool hooded head with bright green eyes. 
Even though we already saw the shield, I got to take a closer look at this. What a cool shield. Of course, it has the little handle on the back for them to hold, and it pops right off. This shield is so cool, though, that it would be a great thing just to have as wall decoration or in a diorama. This is just such a beautifully done thing. I love it. I love the shape of it. It's kind of like a skull. Has a beautiful look to it. Love the elven quality to it. Love the way it's painted. And I just wanted to point that out. This is an awesome sword. I love the color on it and everything. The way it's painted. That look. Oh, that's beautiful. Love that sword. She also comes with the little magical elf-like sword. Very cool, very Lord of the Rings. Love it. She also comes with the two elf-like swords. These things are beautiful. Again, I love the way they did all the handles in this green. Really very elf-like, very cool. She also has this really beautiful very well done, fantastic detail. Also an elven bow, love that color, very cool. She also has the arrow that fits in the little peg so you can, oh, fire it apparently across the room, which is always fun. Yeah, very cool, very nice, very, very nice. And a cool little arrow quiver that you can put on her belt. What a great figure she is. Oh man, I just love the details in this paint. The way they did everything is so nice. The little dots, the chain mail. I love the boots, the way they did the knees, the color they used is just so good. She's a really cool figure. Love the green on the back of the fists. They really did a nice job with her. Really dig those gauntlets she's got on too. They're really, really cool. There's a lot of really neat things that this figure comes with. I am definitely going to use this figure as a body for a couple things that I want to do. I have a... Medusa head that is going to look so cool. Man, I should just pop her on there. Okay, hold on. I'll go pop it on there. I wasn't going to do this, but I see how cool this body is going to look. So one of the things that we just did is we did a Medusa head. I 3D printed it. My wife actually painted this one. Oh, 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 man. And I've been dying to put this Medusa head on this body to see what it would look like. And it is really nice. I think mine might spend some time living as Medusa. That's really cool. So there's just a look. This is a custom Medusa head that I just 3D printed and have on our website now for sale. Wow, love this. I might have to do a couple of pictures with this one on it. But um yeah, let's we'll take a close look. She's pretty cool. Yeah, that's great. I love the colors and everything. They go so well. So definitely, I'm glad I got a backup because one of them is going to live as Medusa in my collection forever. Just love it. Just love it. These guys are so much fun. And I'm going to paint this head up to go with the drow head as well. But So she's great. The, the pieces are awesome. The other color schemes match everything so well. Uh, the extra pieces you get with her 
are awesome. So just like I'm talking about putting a Medusa head on one of these figures, uh, you know, you can switch the chest piece out. You get a lot of really good different looks with these figures, um, with the alternate parts. You can build an army. That's why they're Legion builders. All these are really cool. I'll give you a better look at what she looks like with all these different things on when we do the pictures. So in the photographs, you'll get to see as many, a bunch of different combinations, but let's do some pictures of her. I'm dying to, to see how she looks in some of these photos. I'm already having fun with this figure. I wish I had so many more of them because I'm falling in love with her already. So let's do some pictures and then we'll go back and talk about her. Man, that was a lot of fun. She is an awesome figure. I managed to get two of them, and damn, I wish I had more because what a versatile figure. I love her as the Medusa. Oh my god, that's definitely how one of those is going to live forever in my collection. So, and again, that Medusa is available. I have it for sale up on the webpage with the link below, Trollhead Studios. So there's lots of cool things. I'm so excited about what's coming up. We have the double pack yet to do. In fact, here it is right here waiting. This is the next video right here. I'm excited to open that. I've been really excited. That's been one of my favorite figures from the moment I saw it. I couldn't wait to get my hands on it. That's next. There's lots of cool stuff. I'm doing some neat stuff in this next video you're going to see a lot of the 3D printed stuff start showing up. So, very excited. Thank you all for taking this journey with me, for liking my page and subscribing, and also for your comments and your back and forth with me. I love it all. So, thank you. Thank you all. You all are awesome, and we'll see you next time on Toys in Motion.